Hello YouTube, my name is Tony and today I'm going to show you how to update your T5D action camera from DI uh, using the direct USB program that it will uh, that it will connect our personal computer to the micro USB cable, plugging in directly into the camera and making the upgrade. Now before I begin, there are two variants of the T5V. I have the older one, the non-microphone version. And there is now in the market from, they launched it from uh, May of 2017, a new version of the T5V that is included a microphone input. So you should know that there are two variants of the, uh, of the firmware for upgrades. So you need to go directly to the website of di.com and uh, www.di.com and download the proper uh, firmware for your uh, camera now just to verify the last firmware that we were having on the on the T5V it was I think for, uh, from 28th of uh, February 2017 and uh, Yes, so it's from yes, 28th of February 2017 and I should mention that the new version brings uh, uh, very good new things like uh, field of view from 19, uh, 90 degrees angle, uh, 120 and 166. So uh, that is a big upgrade. Also there is a long, long exposure and I think in the auto balance there is including the diving mode some, something extra in the menu so the first thing we need to, uh, to do is to go to the main page of BI and go to the support area when you press it you will see your two variants of the P5V the, uh, the latest one the, the microphone version and the non-microphone version the older one now, because I have the, the older version, I will download my version of the, of the firmware. Now we are going to open our download uh, file. Now one thing I noticed uh, in the package, because it's from uh, Taiwan, I think, uh, company, uh, there is some uh, uh, Chinese letters in the, in the folder, so I will recommend this, uh, this thing, uh, these letters to delete them and leave only the Latin uh, uh, letters because when we press to install after that the direct USB program, it will not uh, install it because of the faulty uh, name of the folder so we are going uh, we are going into the folder of upgrade desktop to computer and this is the program the direct USB setup so we press it run next next now uh, in this stage, you will have a notification for win uh, from Windows that uh, the driver is not uh, digitally signed, but you need to allow this driver to be installed properly on your on your personal computer, on your laptop. So uh, uh, they should uh, uh, install it the driver properly on on your PC. So install this driver software anyway. You will press. Finish. Now we are going to locate the 
the installation uh, folder because it's not creating a desktop icon on the on your PC. So you will go to C drive, usually in C drive and program files. And there it is the folder umbrella uh, direct USB and direct USB X. Now before we start with the upgrade uh, first thing you need to do is to remove your uh, battery from your action camera from the T5D also and the micro SD card so everything needs to be outside from the camera now the magic combination you need to do so we connect the let me show you this is a micro USB cable it's not the original from the from the camera that I was having that is too short so I have something like 50 centimeters I think something like that same micro USB cable connecting it to your USB uh, output on your PC and right now what you need to do is to press and hold the up button from your camera input input the micro USB into the camera and press two times the mode button or the power button of the camera and you should see a blue light on your camera so the driver now is uh, installing on the on your personal computer and it is successfully installed so we're going now to la launch the the direct USB uh, program and you need to set up these parameter, uh, parameters of uh, of the of the program. So here on the board, you need to choose the A12 AF key and the firmware programming. Also check it. You need to leave this as it is, and you choose your uh, ELF uh, extension for your new firmware so we're going to locate and we download the, the file from the website there it is and you select the latest firmware downloaded from so for the for your T5D action camera all done now just to verify that the connection is uh, everything is set up correctly just uh, press connect just to verify that we have green light for starting the upgrade so everything is okay you just press download and it will start to upgrade your camera The process is about, uh, I think, two minutes to two minutes and ten seconds, something like that. Not a big deal, but uh, I highly recommend it. The direct USB. Uh, if you are in situation and you have uh, a Windows on your personal computer, I recommend this option because sometimes on uh, there were in the past uh, other firmwares. Uh, that they were with uh, the same uh, thing with uh, uh, two files for the upgrade through the direct USB and upgrade through the SD card with the bin extension file. So in some cases, the through the micro or through the micro SD card, the upgrade uh, was resetting uh, the the date and time. So with uh, the version of direct USB using the direct USB, 
Uh, I think the process of the flushing is something different because it's going directly at the chip. So it has some, oh, and the code of, uh, that is written, uh, this uh, upgrade and that one on the SD card, I think they are different. So I think it's better if, if, uh, if you can to upgrade in in this way to the direct USB cable. And that's it. In the end of the flushing process, you will have uh, a green light and saying that the firmware programming success and everything is okay. Just close the program, and you should see that your camera have a white screen behind. But don't worry about that. You just need to unplug the micro USB. Put him back there. The battery and the SD card. And uh, just to say in the end that with the with the upgrade, uh, it is a normal uh, normal procedure of the camera that uh, it will when you start it for the first time after the flashing upgrading the firmware, it will reboot itself one time only and that's a signature that the, that the upgrade has uh, successfully uh, implemented on your T5D action camera. And that's it. Just to verify that we have the latest one, and you see uh, we have uh, an extra, an extra uh, indication for the field of view. And to verify that we have the latest version, there you have it, 28th of uh, June 2017. And this rumor was published, uh, I think, in 10th of July. And that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, the upgrade. And now you can you can do your by yourself, and there is no big deal of upgrading your camera or anything to be scared of. Thanks for watching and bye bye see you next time.